comedy is so unique and to find comedy in everything that you do is beautiful and how it uplifts people. My dad built a toilet in the house that had some stairs on it and I used to perform on there. I did a catwalk on a table in my dad's workplace um, and I used to strut up and down like and be like hmm and then go to the end. I was desperate to be a model, a child model. My first professional role was in This Is England when I was 15. It was quite epic to relive um, a character that Shane Meadows um, had created. I'm trying to suck my tits. It was something that was true to his life story and something that went on in the 80s. It's got a very, like, brilliant sort of sense of sort of art behind it. It's like a Jackson Pollock painting. He just builds it up and up and up. You a proper little skinhead then, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> the smell was very dippy and um, I kind of like, I embraced that really, that dippy character and um, took it to another extreme in my, in my role in Life's Too Short. And I was able to take some of Smell's attributes and thread it through with Rosamond's attributes. And a lot of the time, I am in a reality world when I'm on set. And I do go into like a bubble and the fourth wall comes up. And it's very much like about me sort of channeling that creative energy into my character. I think you're lovely. But it would be nice to like, get a role where I'm stripped back and I've just got me as, as a sort of like blank canvas and I can just do some acting in a school uniform. <laughs> that was a mad crazy teenage um, premonition that I had that I was going to join the circus, however, it's not going to happen. <laughs> Try to be like as true to who you are as you can possibly be. Part of acting is actually going for the castings as well as getting them. So enjoy the castings that you're going for and really go for it when you're there and make a good impression and smile and, you know, just enjoy the castings as well as getting the parts because it's all part and parcel of the process. Oops.